Good morning, my little Sasquatches. <laughs> Sasquatches. My little sweet peas, my little peaches. <laughs> I'm deliriously tired, clearly. I was supposed to film, oh, I'm thinking very slowly right now, so bear with me. I was supposed to go over with AHF to their OTC, which is out of the closet. It's a thrift store and we're gonna do our little thing today, but uh, Avery told me that she had a lot of stuff pop up from other people putting workload on her, so we're gonna push that till tomorrow. So the only thing I really have going is my barber appointment at 11. Two daily vlogs ago, I talked about Eugene and, and having stigma at my old barber shop and how he was there when I needed a new barber and how he's awesome. And right now I'm just gonna go do some cardio really quick then head over and get my hair cut. Whoosh, 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 whoosh. Which as you can see is a hot mess right now. Yeah, it's hot mess. So we're gonna tame the beast. This is awkward. <laughs> I'm here in the little gym in the apartment building. Yesterday, my coach said he wants me to up my cardio, so I'm gonna be doing 55 minutes today. And then, um, actually, if I can come back later tonight, since I don't have anything going on, I'll probably do a second round, either here or when I do my actual workout at Crunch. I usually do my workout in the morning, but I don't have time since I'm going to the barber after this. So I'm just doing a little cardio to start. I was just responding to a Snapchat message from Gabriel Lewis. Just wrote me a really sweet message, you know, supporting me in my competition prep. I guess he's coached some people, some fitness models, and into um, prepping for competition before, so he knows like how exhausting and draining and overwhelming it can be. And I was just saying that I've had such an amazing outpouring of support and love from so many of you guys that like it really has become my fuel in a lot of ways or when I'm feeling tired or hungry and I just want to cheat or I'm like so sore that I'm just miserable. I'm really, you guys pop into my head now every time and it really is helping fuel me a lot towards staying on track and consistent and pushing even harder than I would if it was just for me. I feel like this time around competing has, because I've shared it with everybody, it has become something bigger than it ever was for me in the past. Before, you know, it was a big deal to me, but I was really just doing it for me, because I wanted to, which is still true this time, but I also feel now like I'm also doing it for you guys. I'm accountable to you guys. You know, I want to make you guys proud. Just the amount of support. I even have some people who watch my video and were like, I have some extra cash. I can help you out. I can throw out your way to help you with competition fees and stuff like that. And like, it's just, it's just really nice. And I don't want to take anybody's money. I just want to be able to do this and do it well. So I'm trying to figure it out. And I know I will. It's just the gesture alone and the sentiments means a lot to me. So thank you guys. I, I really do appreciate it. Nothing like getting emotional on morning cardio. So typically on any day, when I go to the gym, usually I'm at Crunch. As a lot of you know, I take my post-workout selfie and then as soon as I get on the treadmill, like that's my time to like do a bunch of socials. So I'll post my selfie and then I'll work on my daily motivation that I post and then I'll just go through probably some DMs and then usually for the majority of the cardio, I turn on Gary Vaynerchuk's latest video and I just sit there and watch that and get super motivated and inspired by his videos. That's my treadmill routine. So now I'm on five minute cool down and then I'll be done. All right, and so I'm just parked. It's like two minutes to 11. That's when my appointment is. And I'm gonna go in and see my barber now. So I have to watch camera shy now. <laughs> <laughs> camera loves me, I can't help it. You never know what you can do until you try. It bad. Yeah. Oh, here's the other one. Oh, 
affirm it, visualize it, believe it, and it will actualize itself. In bed. No matter what the fortune is, you add in bed at the end of it, yeah. perfect. Because your hair lays this way right here. I, yeah. I can, um, I'll shorten it, tap it, but I just have to texturize that and give it a little more volume. Okay. I got you a ticket. Come with me. You have to tell you. Oh, stop. Did you yeah. really? Yeah, you down or what? Aww. I'm so down. Yeah. Alright, good. I just figured it'd be good for, good for you at this moment in time. I said that to your room, but I don't know if there's any information. So I just, it, I paid a hundred bucks for two tickets. They're the same tickets that you would get for a hundred dollars a piece. So, I mean, I wasn't even tight, so, you know, whatever. <laughs> Maybe you can make a little vlog about that shit. Too. Yeah. Because, I mean, oh, can't yeah. wait to go. You've been recording this whole time? Yeah. Oh, Lord. <laughs> You have an iPhone. Yeah. You know Mario Kart is now available? Yes. I haven't got it yet. You already got it? Yeah. It's free. Really? Gary Vee literally just posted something. I know, that's why I knew about it. Yeah, he's the reason why I knew about it too. He's like, good job, Nintendo. There's the videos with these guys with the fucking cameras. See like this, they're like. <laughs> and they look at the camera, they're like. <laughs> oh shit. Chris, fucking white face. There's so much of it came off in the Can't laugh at you, you tell me. What brand is that? Bank tape. Bank tape is your garbage spread. Yeah. Yeah, that's how they always do that. They're like, wait, you got <laughs> Do it again, I gotta focus it. Hey, yeah, I'm, like, I'm like Jesus right here. There you go. Oh. And they go like this. <laughs> oh, shit. No, that's great. Yeah. I went there and asked him. I told him that he, I told him that I had said it was probably around 200. He was like, "Yeah, it's pretty much probably around 200." He's like, "What's his name?" Uh, Daniel. He's there right now. I'm gonna wait and be responsible. So I just got here to the restaurant where I actually used to work. It's closed down now, at least down down here. There's events going on upstairs. So I asked my GM if I could shoot some stuff here for a new show that my buddy Carl, I've mentioned him several times before, we've done a vlog together. He created a show called Plus Life and it's gonna be based online on social media and it's around um, having discussions around HIV and also love, sex, relationships, dating, navigating life as someone who is HIV positive or tackling other STIs and really cool things like that. So um, just a really cool socially conscious show. Obviously has a lot to do with what I talk about, what I'm interested in. So they asked, his, one of his producers actually reached out to me a few nights ago and asked me if I could create a little video of like a cocktail of the week that you might see on different shows. They want to do that concept. So I'm coming up with a cocktail right now. And I'm going to shoot it, try to make it look pretty, and then get it ready for them by tomorrow. So that's what I'm going to be working on. Okay, so it is 12.30 a.m. and I just finished editing um, the video that I needed to edit for Carl's new show, Plus Life. Um, I sent a clip of it to the producer earlier and he liked it a lot, so that's a good sign. It's done, 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 done. And I just finished editing my vlog for September 24th, so that is now uploading to YouTube. It says it's gonna take a couple hours to upload, so I'm definitely not staying up for that. So I'm gonna hit the hay and then wake up early and hopefully be able to post that right, right away in the morning. I'm obviously now I'm like three days behind on my daily vlogs, so I'm gonna have to figure out a way that I can edit these and get them done in a faster way, which probably means like less editing of them actually, less cutting and adding music and effects and all that. I'm just gonna have to like lump this shit together and put it out, which is really hard for me to do because I want it to be good. I want you guys to be interested in it and not bored.
But given my time crunch, I don't really have an option. I just gotta push it. All right.